is the 10 show next this is another group one over 10 furlongs at the top we got Coop Half for Thomas Rogers Court Minstrel for Graham Clutterbuck Diawitz Emella Thomas Rogers Danjo's Legacy M. McMilkerton Finish Ella Alex Cherry Heavy Rain Obi Wan Indigo and Blue Alex Cherry Mystify Craig Beck with Pale Blossom for Martin Lidham Perfect Storm Obi Wan Stingboat Sally Graham Clutterbuck Cuban Maranan for David Robertson Persian King Dan Hughes Veranar for Satyam Birthday Ripple for CDJ Liggett Have Some Courtesy Joshua Sutherland and Santa Monica Emerald for Vinnie Gerrard. So 17 of them in this then. The 10 show. And they're all installed, ready to go. And away they go then. Uh, there's a fairly level break there. Court Minstrel and Birthday Ripple are out quite nicely. And Court Minstrel's got the rail, has got the lead. Perfect Storm there. And the yellow jacket is now cutting across to get that fence for Obi Wan. Pulling for its head, wants to go quicker. Jockey's trying to restrain it. Best he can, but he's gone into a three length lead from Persian King in the blue jacket second. The grey pale blossom is close up in third. Then Birthday Ripple and Diawitz and Mella. Steamboat Sally is after that one and have some courtesy. Santa Monica Emerald is next, looking towards the back. Indigo Blue is the current back. Marker then as they make their way down towards the seven furlong point and it'll be perfect storm that takes them past that seven furlong pole then with a lead off three or four lengths to in second place Persian King Cuban Mananan is next steamboat Sally wide on the track pale blossoms got the rail the grey dial with some is close up Santa Monica Emeralds there as well so steamboat Sally but that one is wide on the track stable mate court minstrels drop right out the back and is the back marker but perfect storm is the leader by about three lengths then racing up towards the five furlong pole and it's perfect storm in the lead from birthday ripple in second persian king and pale blossom then santa monica emerald cuban mananan is after that one then comes steamboat sally diawitz emella is in there as well heavy rain being pushed along to make a forward move but stable mate perfect storm continues to lead but only by two it's perfect storm by two to birthday ripple in second for cdj liggett then comes santa monica emerald pale blossom on the inside persian king now coming through with a run coop half is also now coming with a good looking run round the outside have some courtesy and steamboat Sally are trying to get into it two and a half to go and it's still perfect storm in the lead pale blossom and birthday ripple coop half birthday ripple perfect king cuban man and it's wide open this one but they've got to get past this perfect storm perfect storms in the lead birthday ripple holding in pale blossom wide on the track is indigo blue it's a furlong to go and it's perfect storm in the lead from birthday ripple indigo blue pale blossom trying to burst through right over on the far side indigo blue's going to hit the front here comes pale blossom on the near side indigo blue pale blossom Pale Blossom's in the lead, racing up towards the line. Pale Blossom is going to take it. Pale Blossom wins it. Court Minstrel from absolutely last came through to second. And, well, the 10 0 show has gone to Pale Blossom. And self praise is no praise, as I was once told. But that's a blinding end to the season for me. I've been taking the Grand National, and after seven seasons of being in the SO League. That is my first ever flat group one. So I'm a little bit pleased to say the least. So Pale Blossom takes it for Martin Lidham. Court Minstrel for Graham Clutterbuck was second. The card will roll back down so I can tell you the rest of the places because I can't remember them. Third was Indigo Blue for Alex Cherry. Have some courtesy for Joshua Sutherland was fourth. Birthday Ripple for CDJ Liggett was fifth. So well, there you go. I won the Grand National and now I've got a group one on a flat. Maybe it's time for me to retire and take up chicken farming the same as Craig Allen. <laughs>